Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest known 2K in existence. And listen up, we got a bunch more my player, builder, and gameplay news. We got some 2K24 versus NBA 2K25 gameplay comparison. The truth about Sim Nation has been exposed. <laughs> But yeah, before we get into all that, man, y'all make sure y'all subscribe and like. Get this video to a thousand likes. Nobody will know. Okay, yeah. Now, firstly, what I wanted to show y'all is it's August 5th, correct? Y'all know we supposed to be getting the builder info, my player, my career info today, right? Well, it's not today. It's the week of, okay? And he already responded to this. This is the dev for that. Y'all, if you guys did not know, as you see right here, here is the roadmap, you see? august 5th my player my career and he already said he was going to be talking about the builder and everything and here mike wang said he was going to be now secondly i'm not really going to touch too much on this unless y'all say down below in the comments should i make a video on this sim nation has been exposed okay they've been doing a lot of hating behind the scenes you know these guys are next makers they they influence the game tremendously they represent devs all different type of stuff and they've been hating on your boy tremendously the, the the 2k community tremendously it's a whole uproar on the twitter so y'all make sure to go follow me on twitter you want to see everything i said about it you know uh, ban me a bunch of proof of these talking crazy about your boy and a bunch of other people in the community you know so i just put it out there i've been telling y'all these men hating man you you could call me a lot of things not a liar I do not be talking that cat. Now look at this. We got a defensive buff. Now I'm skeptical about this because this wasn't really in the blog. You would think something like this would like put out there. I don't know. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Mike Wang says, NBA 2K25, if you can anticipate the moves and bump the dribbler, he'll fumble the ball. That's a W. I know y'all think, oh, I'm a spammer, dribble guy, dribble tease. I'm not a dribble guy, dude. This is a W. I, I'm a, I, I love defense. You know, it, this will create a gap if done and implemented correctly. Y'all didn't know my favorite 2K, my favorite 2Ks, the most defensive 2Ks, right? 2K16 was a very defensive 2K. You could really bump people and stonewall them. No matter what they were doing, you know, you had the ability to stop, you know? Deals, it's not defense, guys. 2K24 has no lateral defense, guys. But anywho, he's saying the higher the delta between the defender and the ball handler, the easier it will be to force fumbles. Lockdown's OP. Now, let's see what this guy said. Okay, so this guy quote tweeted Mike Wayne uh, with Dime talking about this. What about improvements to clashes when players exploit size ups to force themselves in front of the defender? Hmm. He talking about the crabbing. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about crabbing. There is a skill to the crabbing, but me personally, you know, I, I enjoyed the golden era 2Ks more. Crabbing wasn't a thing. It became a thing in the newer 2Ks of a way to really score. They know that most people can't actually dribble to get open, so they want to give them little tricks and crevices to try to get their moves off. You know, there's instant moves that put you right behind your defender. <laughs> this is why people be like, oh, we miss this 2k but hey, i've already adapted to the crabbing you know it's you know sometimes it's lame it's fun to do every now and then it's cool but there aren't really many options with how like the offense is and all this and that so it's just gotta, gotta be balanced properly but this guy says tired of anticipating the jamal murray behind the back and not getting a bump the ball hitting my leg or something now i don't really know what he means i feel like if you're in position for the murray you can get that steal pretty often um, I don't know, and he don't seem uh too coherent, really. I don't know. I know sometimes it happens, but I don't. I don't think it's a issue like he really be. But just know, guys. Try, I'm trying to let you know. They make it to where that bump stealing is OD. Bump stealing, not just running up and pressing square. Where bump stealing's OD, the skilled players are gonna super like. You're not even gonna be able to play the game. <laughs> you feel me? That's why they make it to where sometimes the ball don't always get plucked, and it sometimes it phases between you because they know that players like. Like myself other ones with actual working thumbs if you really make it to where you lose it like when someone like on right right on the ball you're 
done. Bro, you you might get ripped 20 times a game. I'm just letting y'all know. Like, if you don't really know how to play. So, I mean, and that's like 70% of the community. Plea, this is great. Oh, there's some great news right there. Have there been any improvements to the physics when two people clash in the air? Physics team spent a lot of time improving our player-to-player in-air collision to make them more reliable and to maintain players' momentum and velocity. Sounds like it can be new. I don't ever remember them ever talking about this, to be honest. Maybe this could address when you meet someone and they phase through you instantly and they get that animation and it's always a make and no contest, even when it shouldn't be. But if they go to the right angle, it's it's, it's, it's lame and corny. Maybe they're saying that's gonna be more stop and you're gonna be able to, you time it all correctly. Mmm, look at this. This is interesting. This is new. Which players do you control in, in Learn 2K minigames? There's three levels to each Learn 2K minigame, and you could choose from a few players who are a good fit for what you're practicing. You're automatically assigned a player for level one, such as the Darian Fox, for dribble speed run. Once you get two stars, you unlock level two and two more players to choose from. Then there are two more players unlocked with level three who are historic players. I wonder, like, why they did it like that? Can you do that online? Has anyone asked that? Am I tripping? Is that is that a dumb question? You know what would be great? But the uh, 2K community day will stop us from that. Imagine if Learn 2K was the demo. Imagine. You get to Learn 2K before the game comes out. Imagine. Wouldn't that be a W? Y'all let me know if that's a W. So Germ tweets out, will NBA 2K25 early access release the same time around the world? I don't know. Y'all let me know, man. I'm not too uh, intricate about that knowledge, but since it's like an early release, will people be able to play in New Zealand earlier? I don't know. But September 4th, 5 a.m., this is a horrible time. <laughs> Now, Germ tweets out the comparison. I think this is 2K25 and this is 2K24. The 2K24 looks more uh, ticking real, but he's saying he updated the hair. I don't know if they did this for 25. I don't know if he's showing an older version here. I'm kind of confused. Germ tweeted out a pro play jumper comparison, okay? It made the KD jumper more realistic, as you can see, you know, the hand, the hand, you know, the flick, the flick. Let me know if this looks more realistic to y'all. A lot of people have been wanting this. Now, as y'all can see, this is 2K25, Brunson Hop versus 2K24. Now, in the 2K24 that they've been saying the pro play this and uh, more realistic than that, they got the damn foot in the uh in the court. I don't think I've seen that in many 2Ks or situations. I don't I don't even know how Joey and 2K Lab even remembered this. How do you remember this? Look, look at this. Look. Hold on, look, look, it's it's in there. How do you even, how do you remember that? But I guess now it's not sinking in the court. Like, I don't, I don't understand. Now this is the SGA size up, 2K25 to 24. Y'all let me know if y'all notice the differences. K24, when combo. Okay. Who knows if it's actually the same move that he's doing. Um, The 25 looks more jerky. In a sense, 24 is more stationary. But if you can really run out those moves that they're doing at 25 at each time, then realistic moves can be used. Like, right? but they don't understand. If you can't run out at any time quickly, it makes realistic dribbling in effect. Running out of moves at any time is realistic, guys. If you guys didn't know, when you're trying to play God and not make them able to have real control over their player to where they can't run out at any time they have to let an animation play through it's not realistic guys okay this is wimby jump shot 25 versus 24 got a little little bit more flick got a little bit more flick i guess it kind of looks the same it's kind of hard to see there's a difference in the hop jumper albertin for 2k 25 and 24 y'all let me know which one y'all prefer five he hops by crisscross okay and this one's kind of different so you know he come back do it like that who knows if this is actually the same animation you know like if it's the same sequence if you still can get hop jumpers like this sometimes with, with his sigs or if they completely change it up who knows if it's the, the direct puts okay What's the main difference between the shot canceling feature and canceling step back shots in previous games? Great question. Oh, they saying the main difference is you can break out at any point. W this golden era 2K sounding like the past you were locked into the shot until a specific point. Okay, guys. That's what I'm 
So realism being locked into animations is not real guys and trying to tell you they're not trying to make it and they haven't been trying to make it more realistic they've been trying to make it more casual and he says the new dribble engine handles the transitions dynamic which looks and feels much smoother than the pre-scripted bridge animations we used in previous 2k sound good this is wolf x 2k league guy he's one of the top players to ever play 2k ever turned into a gameplay dev right this is, this is how he feel about it okay he, he played a lot 2k league all that the new player to court ratio in 2k 25 allows for some more diverse gameplay offensively you have more room for off ball movement dexing leap or just realistic gameplay and cuts. Okay, y'all know when sometimes people cut, you can easily drop off, get back, do all this and that. But now he's saying defensively, it is a bit harder to play two people. I'm assuming he's saying two people and not the two, which is smart. You should have to, you know, gamble and be smart and be able to predict better, not just, you know, get easy bailouts. People should have to play more honest D. Now Wolf tweets out saying one of his favorite ways to use the Rhythm shooting technique is with slow fades and hop jumpers. If y'all don't know what a slow fade is, it is when you don't press R2. When you press R2, you get quicker fades, sometimes harder to time. And then when you don't press R2, you usually get slower fades, easier to time. Usually, depending on the 2K and the fade. But he's probably saying, you know, he's probably trying to give us a little tip that the sauce with the rhythm shooting mechanic is to do it without R2. Now, Precise asks Wolf, do you really think everyone's going to switch to this new mechanic? Now, look what he's saying. This is, I already, I already gave y'all the introduction of, right? He said, yes. He's saying everyone going to switch in general. Well, not everyone, obviously. But he, just to say yes, I don't know if, you know, it's the, you know, he trying to market it properly or whatever. But to, to tell a comp pro-am guy this, that means it should be feasible for their play style, right? If you, if you go off like what everything is being said, logic, and he's saying, but if you want to separate yourself and are competitive you should incorporate rhythm shooting into your game so he's saying this is something that's really uh gonna be game changing it's not just gonna be the the glossy oh i'm trying to you know be realistic and all this and that they saying this it's a new mechanic that's gonna really be some cheese now here's another dev of my career dev he says the rhythm shooting for open jumpers is cool for contested he uses the button and, uh yeah but, you know, he's an NPC. That's what he's saying he like. Anywho, y'all click the video on the screen. Go check out all my other 2K25 breakdowns, man. Turn on them noti. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for when this hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.